as Kilo here, um, I was able to get this uh, Pic Micro uh, flash so that I could actually um, control the digital potentiometer on my little app that I built. What I did is I uh, wired it directly into the audio outputs of uh, this Test64 I'm using here. I tied the 5 volt line directly to the uh, 5 volt output of the regulator on board. I'm using Diddy Kong Racing to test this because it's a pretty loud game. Um, I have it hooked up to this little TV right here, and I'll show you guys uh, this little amp working in a second here. What I did is uh, I programmed the pick so that these three buttons here, the three uh, right ones, this one uh, increases the volume up, this one uh, brings it down, this one here resets uh, everything to zero, so it's like almost like a mute, but it's um, not exactly like that because then I have to, if I want to put the volume back up, I have to push this one several times. Um, it's increasing the volume by, a, I guess you could say, a factor of four, because um, otherwise it would be 256 steps, and the way I have it, it's only 64. So um, here's the two little speakers. Um, here's the uh, clock and data lines going into the digital potentiometer here, and uh, like this is the code I was writing. I kind of had to uh, look at some examples and everything, and I kind of got it figured out. I'm gonna turn this on, and the game's gonna load. And the volume right now on the TV is all the way down, but if you can listen here. There's a little bit of sound coming out of the uh, the little speakers, and it sounds kind of distorted. Like I can't completely um, get the audio to not come through the the speakers, so I don't know what's going on there. But just so you can see that it's the uh, the little speakers putting out the sound, and it's not the TV. I'll turn the TV up. So that's the TV. Put the volume all the way down. So I can come over here. And these LEDs are actually going to show like the value stored in the uh, the register that I'm using to hold the the volume level. And you'll hear the volume increase, and you'll see these LED, these uh, LEDs that uh, start to light up. Oh, it would help if I turn this on. There we go. You can hear the volume getting louder. Then after a while, if I turn it up too loud. The screen starts distorting because I'm running it off of the 5 volt line, so I guess because the voltage is going down on the analog to digital converter, or the DA converter, it kind of affects the video. So then, if I push this button here that I talked to you about, but the whole mute thing, it brings it down again. If I push the down button because it's already at zero, it starts counting down from 256, so the volume goes like all the way up immediately, so it's like. And then they start rumbling up. <laughs> and the screen's really messed up. So that's it. Now I'm just trying to figure out how I can get the sound to completely go away and not like sound a little distorted like that. All right. Thanks for watching.